Hi everyone, Alessandro here. I'm just here to teach you an easy technique to speed up and improve our digestion with a practice called Qigong, which I've been doing for 25 years with my teacher, Xu Jing Wang. So if we initially just move the fingers a little bit, um, the fingers is where we can sense the energy often. And um, when we practice in Qigong, we use the hands to sense the energy and the feet to sense the energy with the earth. So if we move the fingers a little bit, shake them a little bit and the wrists loosen up a bit and I'll explain why in a minute. So after eating we tend to take two to three hours to digest a meal, even a smaller meal. Um, with Qigong we can speed that up to maybe 10 to 15 minutes and that way we avoid getting drowsy, avoid getting sleepy after lunch in the office and things like that. So this is very practical and easy to learn. So if you close the fingers, you can touch the stomach and chest area quite easily. If you open the fingers and you've eaten recently, just soften the tips of the fingers and sense how close you can get to the chest or stomach area. You should feel that there's a cloudy zone here which rejects the hand slightly. If you look sideways, it's usually a few inches off the stomach. So even if you've eaten some time ago, you should feel this rejection. The hands can't get any closer. This cloudy zone puts pressure on the heart, on the whole system, and takes a while, as we know, to actually clear. So with Qigong, if you close the fingers, you can go through this cloudy zone. Go towards the stomach area, upper abdomen, open, you clear this zone, go in, close, open. So this is a very simple technique, it doesn't matter which hand on top, close, open, close, open. You're clearing this cloudy zone and lightening up the whole area. Less pressure on the heart and speeding up the absorption of the food and more importantly the energy from the food. So while I'm doing this I'll explain a little bit. We tend to think that food is, is, of course it's essential for life, but it's not what keeps us alive, nor is air, because if those two things kept us alive we could live forever. So what is it? In the Chinese we call it the qi or energy. We are energy beings. The energy is what helps nature to grow, helps the trees outside to grow and thrive. And same with us, it keeps us alive. When our inner energy expires, we also expire. So of course food is important and necessary, but often it actually takes more energy to digest the food we eat than the energy we get from the food. So the thing to learn from that is that you can actually eat less and get more energy. And I think you'll notice if you do a practice like Qigong or yoga, probably your eating habits change a little bit. So close, open, close, open, just quite precisely. This is one way. Then another way is the back of the hands close over the chest, middle of the chest. Close the back of the hands, open, close, open. So you're clearing again from the center outwards. Close, precise, open the fingers. Open means clearing outwards. One Qigong master, Mantak Chia, often talks about how the stomach has no teeth. Of course we know that, but what that's telling us is that when we eat quickly or don't chew enough, then the stomach receives the food and it can't chew it and it takes ages or maybe can't digest it at all, so it gets stagnant and stuck, the energy. So important to chew as much as possible, use a lot of saliva. Then when the stomach receives the food, it's actually ready and easier to digest. So back of the hands, you can turn the hands the other way. So like in a praying position, close the fingers, open, close, open, close, open. So just precisely closing, opening, closing, opening. And this way, you're just going into this cloudy zone, clearing quickly a few times, 
and do it quite lightly. If you show this to your children, I'm sure you start hearing sounds from their digestion because you can hear actually what's going on more. You get more in tune with your body. So close open. Then with the fingers, see if you can get any closer. You should definitely be able to get closer to the body. We've already cleared quite a lot of this zone. So then another way, quite simple way, is the ring finger, middle finger. Put these together, if you can see that. And then rub the root of the fingers, the root of the middle and ring finger which reflects on the abdomen. So it's like cleaning the abdomen, smoothing the abdomen. You're smoothing and rubbing these fingers together. So this is quite good if you're busy in an office, you don't wanna to show too much about your digestion. You can just be rubbing your hands together. It will be quite an effective way to help speed up the digestion. So just rubbing the root of the fingers. You can go the opposite direction, still rub the root of the fingers. You feel very warm there. The root can feel a bit damp sometimes, then shake it off. Like collect the damp, shake it off. So that's this one, very simple. And finally, for the intestine or lower abdomen area, the back of the hands facing each other at the lower abdomen area. Facing each other, close the fingers, open, clear out, close, open. Imagine you're going behind the intestine. Intestine is 20, 30 feet long. Very long, often gets stuck. And this way we're actually imagining going behind the intestine, cleaning, clearing very quickly. So actually speeding up the digestion where we absorb the food. Because if the intestine is stuck, quite hard to absorb. And often by the time we've um, when we get to the next meal, we haven't digested the previous meal. So the body or the stomach saying, you know, I'm not ready for the next meal. But doing this, you digest very quickly, precisely, cleanly. A few more times. So just to recap, close open at the top, the fingers, close open. Back of the hands, close open, very easy to remember. Turn the hands this way, close, open. That's for the upper part. And then you can do ring finger, middle finger. And lower part, back of the hands, close, open. Finally, you can just use the thumbs to clean the middle line more. This is where a lot of the congestion is. So we're just cleaning it, clearing it, off. If you want to find out more about Qigong classes, one-to-one -one sessions, corporate workshops, just have a look at flowinghealth.co.uk, the website. Quite a lot of information there and please get in touch if you want to know more. So finally, open the fingers, feel, should be able to touch or nearly touch the body. A lot of the digestion has worked and cleared. So do this after a meal. You can follow this video anytime and you know post any comments if you have any any um, comments on this and how it worked for you and um, hope your digestion improves day by day and thanks for watching.